All right, I just wanted to show you guys where I live. I actually live in New York. If a lot of you guys didn't know, this is where I'm from. I'm actually hanging out on my roof right now. Uh, that first part was New Jersey. Right over there, that's Yankee Stadium. These guys, I don't know what they're doing this year. They're, they're a little drunk, but they're, they're finally stepping out. All right, you guys are probably wondering why am I why is this place looking so empty? Usually it's like really packed and there's a whole bunch of things. Well, my floors actually got waxed the other day, so I still haven't put everything back in its space. Uh, there's gonna be a whole bunch of rearranging and stuff. So that's why, that's why honestly, it looks different, but it's really the same spot. It's just, I haven't moved everything back. So I still have everything packed in, in both the rooms. So it's, it's a lot of stuff that I've been moved. So yeah, today in this video, I'm actually going to talk about um, hospitals versus barracks. I'm going to speak about why I made the switch, because I recently made the switch myself to, to full barracks over hospitals and who should use what, what type of buildings. And yeah, that's, that's what I'm going to touch upon in this video. So I'm basically going to give you guys a comparison. So uh, let's get this started. So first of all, let's get right into it. And when when I started making my videos, I actually I was full on hospitals. I was only using hospitals. And the reason why I used hospitals is because I was taking way too many hits back to back to back to back to back. And my gear was not up to par to like the, the amount of hits I was taking. So I was I didn't want to lose too many troops and not and just lose them completely because if you have full barracks um if you lose a bunch of troops you're just losing them if you have full hospitals uh, a big hit won't hurt as much you might lose a, a little less troops uh, hospital beds might fill up but you'll lose less troops as if it was full barracks so that's that's the main reason why i honestly never really switched over to full barracks um I'm at a point right now where my gear and my gems and my stats are really, really pushing my defense really high. Like right now, before I made the switch actually to full barracks, um, I I was at 2,800 and something defense. So that's pretty, I was taking hits and the hits weren't hurting me as bad as you guys can see in the kiloband videos. So the hits weren't, weren't crazy, but so I, I in my head, I was thinking maybe if I make the switch, um, the hits still won't be as crazy and I'll still have more defense and the bad hits won't hurt as much. So that's why I kind of made the switch over. I did some testing and the testing, it seemed all right. Um, yeah, there's going to be a few hits that are going to hurt a lot. But uh, for the most part, the, the hits, they weren't they weren't like killing too many of my troops. So it was it's, it's a great thing. Uh, if your defense is really, really high, <coughs> I suggest maybe switching to full barracks. If your defense isn't high, like you're just boarding around 2,000 defense, I, I don't think it's worth it because if you get hit, honestly, you're going to get crushed. Like, and those hits are going to hurt you. Like, you're going to lose so, so many troops. And you don't want to lose so many troops. It's ridiculous to have to rebuild all those troops. All right, some of you guys know I'm from New York. Uh... People do not know how to act in New York. It gets like 70 degrees out and people decide it's it's okay to start fucking sun tanning on the roof. Like, really? Really? Come on. Are you serious? It's only 70 degrees out today. You playing too much, girl. You play too much. And another, oh, uh, that's one thing I forgot. Another big reason why I didn't switch is because at the time, like earlier when I when I was playing these few past few months, I didn't have as many speeds as I do now. And I didn't have as much gold as I have now. So now it's okay for me to like lose a lot of troops. Let's say for some reason I, I do one of my crazy stunts that I decide to take a mini rally or something. Uh, I lose a lot of troops. Okay, whatever. I can rebuild because I have the speeds or I have the golds to actually keep on rebuilding. So. 
right now I'm in a good place because I have speeds and I have gold and I have um, resources. So it doesn't hurt me as bad to have, to have full, full barracks over four hospitals. Four hospitals, it was easier for me to like not lose as many troops and not have to use as much speeds or resources or whatever. Even though I did use speeds and resources, it would not have been as bad as, as, it, is, as it is now. So, so now, um, my defense is really high, so honestly, I, would, I wouldn't recommend making a switch for everyone. I would only recommend it to people that are like, their defense is like crazy, crazy high or something. Because if it's not crazy high, it's not gonna be worth it. You're just gonna get like demolished every single time. And if you don't have speeds to to rebuild from a really bad hit, then it's also gonna be a waste. So those are the main reasons why I made my switch. Like personally, uh, I don't think it's for everyone. Honestly, I think it's better suited if your defense is high. I can't give you a number exactly how high, but I just want me myself. I wanted to be over three thousand percent defense once I pass. Once I switched over to full barracks, so right now my defense is at three thousand one hundred. I believe it's something. It's something like that. But yeah, I didn't want to be under three thousand with full barracks because the hits would have been bad still. So. That's, that's why I made the switch. A lot of people honestly have been telling me in the comment sections, in the game, in my PMs and mail, why don't you switch to full barracks? Why don't you keep, why don't you switch? It's just, I didn't, at the time it wasn't suited for me, honestly. But now it's, now that I have speeds, I have gold, um, my defense is high, everything's clicking for me. So it, it made sense to actually make the switch. So right now I'm full barracks, and yeah. Hospitals, they're nice. They're nice. They're really helpful for people with lower defense and smaller players. Yeah, definitely very helpful. Um, so yeah, that's that's basically why I switched. That's why I switched over. So if you guys are trying to decide why you should switch over, those are some things you should think about. You should weigh out the options, your speeds, your resources, the gold, whatever you have. Um, you, you want to think about it. Your defense stacks also that plays a major, major role in deciding if you should switch over or not. So yeah, mostly rally traps have full barracks and some solo traps have it, like the solo traps with really good gear, they do have it, but if your gear is not that good, I wouldn't recommend doing it, honestly. Yeah, so keep that in mind and yeah, that's that's basically it for that. All right, so um, for my next video, uh, I'm not sure what's my next video, to be honest. Uh, but I believe I will be releasing another video tomorrow. Yeah, I think, yeah, I think I decided another video tomorrow. So let's just keep the ball rolling. Uh, if you guys enjoyed the videos, feel free to leave a like, subscribe if you are new, because there is a ton of stuff coming up. Uh, a ton of great footage and if you're new actually just you can go back and see all my old kill event stuff yeah they can help you it can help you decide to see live action on the spot see see how how you should react to certain that certain actions um if you if you want to join the in-game chat join the jackrabbit trap room that that room there's a ton of people it's a a whole bunch of helpful information if you need information you can feel free to drop by and just ask any question and someone will help you uh what else what else what else what else uh yeah oh in the comment section what are we doing today should we do no packs or should we do jack rabbit traps or should we do both no packs jack rabbit traps hmm you guys decide actually. So you decide either if you want to write no packs or jackrabbit traps. So whichever one you want to write, you can leave in the comment section if you enjoyed the videos. <laughs> so um, I will see you guys in the next video. I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, Till tomorrow, stay awesome guys. Peace.